Good afternoon, guys. We're here at Fit Factor today to show you two exercises that will improve your posture. So we're here talking about posture today. What exactly does it mean to have good posture? Does it mean walking around like a peacock? Nope. We're really not conscious of what good posture is throughout the day. It's more engaging your back muscles and making sure that you're not slouching. I would always remember my mom would tell me, hey, you need to fix that posture. And what does that mean exactly? Well, now I understand. I'm engaging my abs. Uh, again, you're contracting your back muscles. Now, who does it apply to? It actually applies to everyone. You have your moms, you have your workers, you have athletes, and your moms do stuff all day, every day. And you have your everyday worker who's sitting down for eight hours. At the end of the day, they're slouching over the keyboard. And then athletes, athletes, it's so important for you to have good posture because it will mean you will perform better. Now we're actually gonna run through a couple exercises that will enable your posture to improve. And the more you do these exercises, the more your posture will get better. All right, so for this exercise, the props you will need is yourself, which Mike is gonna be playing, uh, a foam roller, which if you have one of these at home, kudos to you, and then a mat, or if you prefer, you can do this on the ground as well. Now, where are we gonna place this foam roller? We wanna place this foam roller right between your shoulder blades, between the biggest muscle in your shoulders and the biggest muscle outside your back, right? So what I'm gonna have Mike do is he actually, he's actually gonna lay down on the foam roller, right? Key points, right? A lot of people have neck issues, so we wanna make sure you support your neck, which is completely fine. You wanna have your hands right on your head. You wanna make sure that your hips stay low, when I mean low, all the way to the ground, and then you wanna make sure your feet are touching the ground as well, right? So another thing too is we wanna make sure we're breathing through this. That's the biggest issue. We don't breathe nowadays, right? And when you think about it, if you're not getting the most out of your breath, you're not getting the most out of this exercise or any you perform. So what we're actually gonna do is you're actually gonna come back, Mike, go ahead and come back. As you come back, you inhale. And then on the way up, you're gonna exhale. There you go. Now you always, your exhale will be longer than your in inhale. Now what's going on in this uh, motion? Go ahead, do it again for me, Mike. Is you're actually contracting your back, which in a way, strong back means that you'll walk better and you won't be slouching. Again, go ahead, come up, Mike. Uh, you're also stretching out your chest and your midsection, um, which again, it's so important for posture. All right, for this following exercise, the only things you will need is yourself and a mat if you wanna be comfortable. Otherwise, you can do it on the ground. Now, what we wanna have here is Mike is, actually has the best hand placement. He has his hands right underneath his chest and his knees right underneath his hips. Now, the first movement of this exercise is Mike is gonna pretend like he's pinching my fingers, right? Now, when he does this, he also creates an arch in his back and then, also remember guys, we gotta keep breathing. He's gonna exhale on the way up, which is the opposite movement of this exercise, which will in, in a way stretch out your back. So go ahead and push up, Mike. You're gonna pretend like someone's pushing on your chest upward all the way until you have this opposite round back. Um, again, it's gonna stretch out your back and it's actually engaging your abs as well. Uh, this is a great exercise for you to do at home. Uh, you can actually do this at work if you got time. Um, the more you do it, the more uh, and better your posture will get. Just like that. So inhale on the way down. There you go. And he's going to exhale on the way up. Notice how his arms stay locked out. There you go. Keep breathing. Push out. Go ahead, Mike. Very good. One more time. Breathe on the way down. Engaging all the back muscles. And then we're going to exhale on the way up. Very good. Now guys, these exercises are not supposed to fix any real issues that you have. For that, I recommend a doctor. 
Now we're gonna try to release a video a week in order for you guys to know a little bit more about the body or you guys can let us know what parts you wanna focus on. Thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Have an awesome day.